You know, definitely a good player in our team. Um, you know, we don't re really replace a guy like that, but you know, someone has to step up, and uh, I think we have players in this team that can do the job and, and you know, elevate their game and kind of help uh, thinking what Norris is bringing to the game. So, uh, you know, I thought Brass did a great job last game coming in and after two weeks and playing so solid like that. So, um, yeah, obviously a tough loss, but uh, we're going to have to step up. There was a lot of questions if your line might get shuffled around with Pinto moving out, but he's going to stay there. How, how nice is it to keep some consistency? Yeah, it's nice. I mean, things change. Uh, you know, obviously we're on a four-game winning streak and things are, are rolling pretty well right now, but, uh, you know, there's things that can happen and things can shuffle after. So, um, you know, hopefully we can keep building chemistry with that line. And, uh, you know, I've been, I've been uh, liking playing with these two and how hard they work and how well they play defensively, and I think it brings a... It brings a, a lot of offense uh, from from a defensive zone. So um, obviously, the, you know, the coaching staff are going to do a job and find what's working. So, uh, but I'm not really worried about the the line combination. Is there something that stands out more than anything else in this four game streak here? Um, you know, I think resiliency. Uh, you know, I th I thought we I think we might have given up the first goal maybe every time beside the home opener, and um, you know, the guy just stay resilient and. We came back from a couple leads and, um, you know, being down early and, um, you know, I don't think we, we panicked in those four games and I think that's the that's the main thing. Even in our home, home opener, I thought, you know, they came back and we could have, you know, kind of panicked a little bit there, but we didn't. And um, hopefully we can do that and keep showing how mature of a team we are and um, seeing how funny Zuby is in the back and <laughs> uh, it just makes it, you know, makes the environment great. <laughs> that's tough. But that's been a big thing, right, staying on the with Kale. On an even what? Keel. I don't know what that means. Like not getting too high. Oh, yeah, like being in the middle? Yeah, yeah, of course. Balance is important. I mean, like I said, it's a long game and it's a long season. Um, you know, you don't win the game in the first five minutes of the game. Uh, you know, I've been in some games where you're, you're down 4 nothing after the sec after two periods and you come back and win the game. So, you know, there, there's so many so much parity in, the, in this league and so many good players. I think we have the firepower of scoring three or four period if we can't. If we can, then um, you know. So if we keep going and play uh, a player games and you know play 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 hard, I think uh, you know we can score. We can score tons. So um, you know, I don't think we can put our, our heads between our tails and um, stop working and quit there. What was your Halloween costume last night? Uh, I was Tyler Creator Igor, uh, the album cover. The guys in this room, we've been here for obviously a while now, and we're we're starting to figure it out. And the new guys coming in just. Uh, brought a lot of experience and you know going into the third period we knew exactly what we had to do the last few games especially when it was tight and uh, we've done the job and you know we know we can do it and we just have that confidence and uh, obviously yeah we're looking to make it five in a row tomorrow would be, be great. You're one of those guys that's been here a while is there have you noticed a difference in the ability to handle momentum shifts? Yeah no for sure I mean uh, when we were younger, me and the other guys would probably get a little more frustrated when uh, we were down early. We thought we were out of it, maybe something like that. But you know, as we're getting older, we're we're maturing and you know, we're sticking to the system, and it's been paying off. So um, I think whether it's scoring in the first period or sticking to the system all the way to the third period and getting a goal, we know uh, what we have to do, and we're we're going to stick to that. What's your reaction to just Josh being out for a long time? Yeah, it's tough. I mean, obviously, we spent a lot of time out together last year together. We were both injured, so no, it's obviously tough. We're going to miss him, but, uh, you know, we're going to be here for him. Um, you know, I've been in that situation, obviously, maybe not as long, but, uh, you know, we'll get through it, and obviously we're going to miss him in the dress room. Uh, he's, a, he's a great guy. How did he seem as you talked to him here the last few days? I think he was pretty upset, obviously, after the game. But the last two days, he's he's been great. He's uh, such an awesome guy. He's not gonna he's not gonna bring uh, any negative energy into the room. Uh, you know, when you're injured, it's tough. Obviously, you want to be playing. And, uh, for me, last year, I remember just coming in trying to be as positive as I could, and um, that's exactly what he's been doing. Brady have been on a pretty good run here. Have you guys tried to lift your game? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, you know, we want to we want to win. We want to bring this team um, into the playoffs. Um, you know, going forward and, and now. So obviously, we're doing anything we can to help the team win. It's our job to, you know, produce. And uh, you know, we've been trying to do that. And obviously, uh, we've been getting the wins. So you know, we'll, we'll continue to do that.